We good? Yeah, the thing came out. Alright, well, I'm gonna count off to four. Are you ready? Alright, right, this is how it should be. It should be a one, two, three, four, one. And on the one, we click to go. Alright. You ready? Yes. One, two, three, four, one. Alright, I think we I think we got that well. Agreed. Alright. Have you ever played this game actually? I I have never played this is Sonic Heroes. Yeah, Sonic Heroes for the GameCube. I have never played Sonic Heroes for the GameCube. I never owned one. Oh my goodness, it's it's okay, but like you see what I'm here, you see what I'm doing here. I'm um, I just see the cheesiest <laughs> anime-esque ending of a level I have ever seen. It's almost as bad as Pokemon when they give the peace signs. <laughs> I just, like, spammed that whole thing. Like, all I did was, like, I just used one button, as you saw in that video. Yeah, nice. like, it was, it was spam-tastic, and, like... You, it, it, the game encourages you to use, like, strategy between switching between Sonic, Knuckles, and Tails. But I find that if you even try to do that, you, you can, like, kiss your ass goodbye. You know what? Fuck Tails. <laughs> Tails is so lame. I, I got through Sonic 1 through 3 and, of course, Sonic and Knuckles 1 through 3. Um, and I did play Adventures as well, but... God damn, if Tails isn't the most annoying character in video game history, I don't know who is. Because Sonic is so badass. And then you just have this squirrel... <laughs> Whose tail spin around? I don't understand it. Uh, Tails is like meant to be the partner. Like I think he was just made for like two player action for Sonic Two. But he he, he is he always sounds like he has a cold. Yeah, exactly. Especially in this game. Does he ever grow? No, up? he's he's forever twelve. Oh my goodness! Is like the the thing about this one that was great or not great, but like what made it interesting that everyone got excited about was it was supposed to have like a retro look. That's why we're at the casino level, which was, you know, famously in Sonic 2. Yeah, yeah, And, like, see, God, it had, like, small little puzzle elements like this that pissed me off. Jeez. Like, and I, I have to ask, be, being not 100% familiar with the Sonic franchise, yeah. I know that, that Knuckles was kind of the dark villain. When did he become ally? <laughs> like, does anybody know? <laughs> um... <laughs> It's always been uh, implied and also written in the manuals of Sonic 3 and Knuckles that um, Knuckles was tricked in, the, in those games. Uh, and that Egg Eggman... He was yeah, essentially. Eggman tricked him into um, thinking that Sonic was after the Master Emerald. In which, in Sonic Adventure 1, he gets, he gets tricked again by Dr. Robotnik that Sonic is after the Master Emerald. And it's just like, Knuckles, right? He's a yeah, fool. Learn your life. When we learn. Knuckles. I think you commented on this earlier, that, that Tails, in his girly little arms, being able to kill yeah. the most baddest of asses, Knuckles <laughs> and Sonic. I don't think that that's possible, but whatever. It's, it's I think it's a squirrel, at least. A he's squirrel? a fox. He looks, he looks somewhere between a squirrel and a lynx. <laughs> that's true. Oh, man. Like, that is, I don't that see is way too much weight. Like, you remember, you, yeah, that's what you remember Sonic 3, where um, he had, like, trouble fighting that boss... Yeah, 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 where, where uh, you're, you're in the airplane and it blows up and then Sonic is has to be carried. Yeah. Oh, that was a that. good fight. But, like, he had he had a problem carrying him there. I mean, to add Knuckles on the mix. He'd go off the screen every time and I'd always think I was about to die, but I never yeah. would. <laughs> I understand. Yeah, but, like, like, you take that and then you take into the consideration that, like, now he can carry both Sonic and Tails without, without a problem in the world. Like, that's just too much. Fuck these turtles. And if you see here, the robots have like bunny ears for some reason. Yeah, there's some things I will never understand. In the Sonic franchise, I don't, I don't get it. Oh, you, you, you asked earlier who was the most annoying character in the series? Yeah, who would that be? Some people would um, argue to say Silver. From Silver. See, see, I didn't get that. Far. Yeah, yeah, you, you're good. You don't even, you don't even need to play this game. Sonic 06 <laughs> is bad. <laughs> it was bad. See, see, I got my PS3, and the first game I got was Sonic 06. Oh. I played the first level, and I was, I wanted to die. 
Like, my childhood hopes and dreams were just shattered before me, <laughs> and I gave up. Like, uh, you shouldn't even try with that game, man. It's just a waste of time. I get. I didn't know. I just got the system. Like, I didn't know either, because, like, like I said, my first intro back into Sonic was Sonic and the Secret Rings, which was an okay game at yeah, best. Yeah, yeah. But, um, then I was like... I actually thought I did play some... How was that? What did you think, personally? It was alright, you know? You know what the one problem was, though? It, it took that? forever to, to level up and reach a speed that was entertaining. If they, yeah. If, like, if they just gave them the decent speed that they give you after, like, three days of gameplay, like, it would be so much more fun to play, because, like, from there on, you can only get faster, but you start off so freaking slow. It's ridiculous. Get up, Tails. Oh, what the hell did yeah, I had to like hit a switch. And I'm just trying to get Knuckles to work. I don't know who in Sonic Team thought this would be fun. <laughs> like see? That was just bad. Um like yeah, I mean I guess it would I said before in the earlier videos that it would have been awesome if they just like had only Sonic. Yeah, I could see that. Or, or even, like... Just separate characters. Yeah. Actually, not even that, because, like, it's gotten to a degree where, like... S like, you know, Sonic 3 and Knuckles, it didn't... If, okay, with Sonic 3 and Knuckles, when you combine them together, the levels were, um... Were, like, similarly the same, but very different. You know? Yeah, yeah, no, I definitely understand. But, like, but, um, but what, what's... Wait, 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 all right, wait, wait. all right. Yeah! <laughs> But what Sega's been doing lately is they've been too tired. Like, if they add more characters into the game, essentially what you're playing is just, like, another remake of the same level, but just not as drastically different as it was in, like, Sonic 3 Knuckles. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. So, like, I if I were to play this with Team Dark, it would essentially be the same structured level, just with, like, different placed enemies. Yeah, that makes sense. That was a goddamn long time to ring up a score. It, it's... It, I know. Let's see. This is still going for you. Yeah. Just finished the. You got a uh, B. You're terrible. Think, it's a B. It's it's for badass. I think it's B for could have been better. How do you start with that? That's a C. No. Maybe. I don't know if you maybe believe. been better. Been better. Yeah. yeah. See, there you go. Now you're. Thinking. I'm always thinking. <laughs> That's a true statement as well. That's not a ludicrous one. Oh. <laughs> you know what's horrible about this one? The steering. You see me struggling there? I don't blame you. This looks awkwardly challenging. It is. Like, when you're on the highway and, like, later on the walls just fall and, like, you have to stay in the middle. I'm, like, I'm twitching all over the place, but that's not me. That's not my fault. It's because <laughs> the steering is horrible. It handles horribly. Well, I guess... Sega thought after the vast success of Sonic Spinball that a pinball <laughs> episode or level was necessary. It wasn't that bad. I thought Sonic Spinball was kind of fun. Yeah, I think man. it was okay. You know what? I just wanted to be Sonic and I just wanted to be jumping on people's heads. That's true. But pinball wasn't that bad. That's my my dream. <laughs> pinball wasn't that bad though. I mean, it kept the it kept the same elements, but just like did it a little differently. Yeah, I guess. I mean, like if you want to be a prick about. It. <laughs> I w maybe I will be a prick about it. And maybe the... I thought that's why I was... Me <laughs> oh, craps, come on. What is this? <laughs> what do you mean? What is this? <laughs> Giant dice. <laughs> oh. We're a few seconds off because I just got to the giant dice. Uh, uh. It's not that bad. It's slightly creative. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> this is where I fall. I thought I, I thought it was good. Uh, I've never fallen off that before, so like when that happened, I literally said, where do I go? <laughs> now, I know in uh, Sonic Unleashed, they were talking a lot about different tiers to the levels. Like, no, Hold on, we've got like 20 different... seconds left. We can hold up next time. Oh, never mind. If you, join us next if you time. Wanna, not, yeah, not. join us next time. With command and commentary uh, for the Sonic Heroes playthrough part 5. Alright, uh, any closing statements, John? My video's over, so no. Oh, okay.